It's Charlie. Welcome back to another episode of Virtual Families 3. Today, I'm doing this voiceover style because the audio I recorded with the video was not good. So yeah, we're just going to jump right into this video. Um, and I have a lot of things to catch you guys up on. And you will see here in a minute that things have changed quite a bit. So here we are in the game. And the first thing I want to do is jump into the family tree. Because as you can see, Christy and Arrow, they were doing good. They had a bunch of kids. The generations were going all good. Um, we kept PD. And then, yeah, yeah. So basically, it ended the fourth generation. The game just told me randomly that my family had been lost. So I had no choice but to restart and adopt a new family. So I adopted Kyle. I thought he was a pretty cool guy. Um, and he had a bunch of kids with Star. And then um, Dominic inherited the house, married Roxy. They had a couple kids. And we um, had Alex inherit the house. And now here we are with Alex and his three children. He married Missy. Um, she has rainbow hair. But yeah, so let's get into this. Um, so this is Missy right here. I'll just show you they look all the whole family. And I realized we had an Elizabeth a couple generations ago. So we are just going to name her Beth. She is named after one of her relatives, but still. Um, okay, so now um, I want to show you how the house is looking. We have here the parents' bedroom. I mean, the kids' bedroom. Sorry, excuse me. Um, we have a workshop, we have the bathroom, of course, we have, um, the parents' room, and this will be a bathroom soon, as soon as I get the money to upgrade. We have this room, which I don't know what to do with yet, so just has some random stuff in it, <laughs> and then the office, of course, and then we have the living room, I finally have matching furniture, and, um, that room I don't know what to do with yet either. So yeah, that's pretty much the whole house, and um, also this kid is being evil. Oh yeah, I gotta drop the sound. Of course, you guys can't even hear the game. Okay, so he's be he was being evil, so I just scolded him, and um, yeah, we got this lawnmower at an auction. It's super cool. We got a really cheap. It was one of those little things that pop up, you know, the events or whatever. Yeah, we got that for really cheap. I could have sold it, but I kept it because I wanted to. But they keep saying there's no lawn to mow, so it's really weird. So in the last video, um, I believe it was, somebody asked if they could, if I could show the goals. So here I am. I'm going to show the goals. If you would like, you can stop this video, like pause it so you can read them a little closer because I'm just going to go through really quickly so that people who don't want to see them don't have to watch them this whole time or really skip through the video too much. But yeah, guys, so far, my impressions of this game, I think it's amazing. I love the game. Um, I like that there's more diversity with people and... Um, you can marry same sex. There's all kinds of like new things and new personality traits and all kinds of stuff that I really, really, really like. I really enjoy this new Virtual Families. A lot of people think the house looks like the first Virtual Families game. I don't really think so, honestly, but um, the first Virtual Families game is my favorite. But this will probably be my new favorite once the game is finished. There are a lot of glitches, such as like a money glitch and a glitch where my items stick to the trash can. So yeah. The one thing I really don't like is that the furniture looks the same as Virtual Families too. Like, they recycled it. I would really like some new, fresh furniture, new looking things for the house. Rather than things that look like they came from the old game. I don't like that at all. Another thing I really wish we could do is send our people away for a haircut. Like, we could call on the phone and say, like, schedule a haircut. And it could be, like, $75 or something. You And then they could go out the door or out the gate, come back with new hair, and, like, you could have, like, a few choices of hair and hair colors, and they could come back with their new hair. I think that would be really amazing. Oh, yeah, but we found a collectible, and I'm speaking of collectibles, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys collectibles after I'm done showing you this big zoom out of the, how the house looks. All right, let's jump into collectibles. So we have an earwig here. Um, that's the only bug we've found. Um... 
and none of those we just got the contract uh we have two feathers three now counting the one the mom got we have half of the toys we have most of this picture i think it's a family like what else would it be it's kind of cute kind of like that mustache guy creeps me out <laughs> but yeah okay so alex works in the workshop he doesn't really like working on his career very much um we just had this workshop built before he inherited the house but yeah he's on level three and he doesn't make that much he's about halfway through um but yeah he doesn't really enjoy working it seems like i've never had one of these in, um finish their career yet which kind of sucks and this is missy this is link and this is beth and then the third baby they um have it's like wrapped up or whatever um so something i noticed is when you adopt a baby or something someone told me now i haven't been able to adopt one yet because i really haven't needed to <laughs> but yeah when you oh she's so cute she's so cute dancing um but when you adopt a baby i guess i've heard that the dad holds it first instead of the mom which is really really cute i think i like that a lot so I don't really know what else I wanted to show you um, on this episode. But yeah, I really thought I needed to catch you guys up. And I hadn't made one um, for a while. So yeah, um, the, our maid is finally here picking up the, the, the freaking socks and stuff. Um, now I'm going to go ahead and give you guys a whole view of like the house like from far away. But yeah, that is pretty much all I wanted to show you guys in today's video. If you have any questions or anything, leave it in the comments below and I'll try to answer it in my next video. Or I'll answer the question in the, in the comments. Anyways guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you all next time. Bye! Oh, and please subscribe to my other channel, Hate Charlie, and please subscribe here and turn on the bell so you know when I upload because I don't upload very often. And yeah, guys, see you later. Bye.